And now a new at six, a dog bite attack in Fort Lauderdale sends two people to the hospital. CBS 4's Joe Murray is live with the scene of where that attack happened earlier today. And Joan, another dog attack. Yeah, thankfully, Elliot, this one was not deadly like that one that happened just a few blocks from here last week. This happened off Northwest First Avenue and Sunrise Boulevard. It happened behind a corner home that is uninhabitable. Take a look. Now, that house has a lot behind it, and people are living in makeshift conditions under tents. The two people were walking by, and we understand from police, two pit bulls attacked a man and a woman. The man and woman were taken to Broward Health. Fire Rescue told me that the man had a six-inch gash on his calf. The woman was hurt on her ankle. Both required stitches. Police say they were forced to shoot one of the pit bulls because it charged an officer, and that dog had to be euthanized. But there is another animal still alive. Here is a picture of that surviving pit bull. It is now being held at Broward Animal Care and Control. Police tell me this incident is under investigation. So what happens now to that surviving dog? Well, we are told by animal care that the owner has to come forward, but all depending on this investigation will determine its fate. Again, that man and a woman, they were treated at Broward Health not far from here. Uh, they both required stitches, but they are non-life-threatening injuries. Reporting live in Fort Lauderdale tonight, Joan Murray, CBS4 News. Joan, thank you.